Hello everyone, it's me, Nicole, your electrolysis goddess, here in Electro Yogi Electrolysis in Los Angeles. And today I would like to talk about where are the important areas to do electrolysis. Does electrolysis work best on certain areas versus others, certain skin type versus others, certain hair type versus others? And the answer is yes and no. When we think about electrolysis, what I hope I can help people understand, because unfortunately there's a lot of misinformation out there, disinformation out there, and with laser hair removal becoming this ubiquitous Kleenex version of how we think when we think about hair removal, it does a disservice to those of us for whom laser does not work, definitely does not work forever, and does not work on certain hair, and more importantly, in certain areas, makes hair that we did not have before. So that's the, what I'm trying to help everyone understand because you're not gonna get this information for better or worse from most laser companies and you're also not gonna get this information from a waxing studio. You're not gonna get this information from your local threader. You're not gonna get this information even from many dermatologists and doctors. Now, occasionally you will, but what's important for me to help convey to you as a service is that because I don't want you to spend more time and more money than you have to to get rid of your unwanted hair because the process takes long enough, right? So electrolysis will work on any hair color, any skin type, meaning if you have gray hair, electrolysis will get rid of it permanently. If you have blonde hair or red hair, electrolysis will get rid of it permanently. If you have very dark, dark, dark black hair and very dark, dark, dark skin, electrolysis will get rid of that hair permanently. So there's no hair color and no skin type for which electrolysis cannot be effective. And by effective, I don't just mean a reduction. I don't just mean it goes away for a while and then comes back eventually. I mean forever and ever permanent you never have to worry about this again. So that's one of the most important things to convey. The other thing is, we've talked about this in other videos, but when to laser, when to electrolysis, or when to electrolysis and when to laser. I never want people to laser their face ever unless you have so much dense, thick hair that it is a completely full thick beard and it's very dark and you have very light skin. And the reason I say this is that I have had hundreds of clients over the years. Our team has had hundreds of clients over the years who have come to us tearfully because they lasered their face. They had a few coarse hairs or they had an upper lip or they had a chin with some hair and then they ended up with hair elsewhere, cheeks, under the chin, neck, hair that they didn't have before that ends up growing like this long, like an inch long, and it gets dark. So we don't want that for you. I definitely don't want that for you. So please don't laser your face. And if you're gonna start with laser on other parts of the body, then you finish with electrolysis to get rid of it all. On your legs, for example, or your bikini perhaps, um, those are the main areas where I see a lot of success with lasering. Now, electrolysis, I'm going to almost always, always, always recommend it for you from the chest up or the belly up, including underarms, including the back of the neck, gentlemen, including the ears, and of course, our beautiful faces. I believe in my heart, <laughs> based on 13 years of doing this, and having people in tears in my office about hair removal gone wrong, tweezing that's made a gazillion hairs more coarse or darker, thicker than they had before. Just a vicious cycle that people end up that electrolysis is absolutely the way to go on your face. I also believe on your stomach, your chest area, <laughs> your back of your neck, your underarms, 
and many more areas that we can talk about. The feet, the hands. So these are the areas that I recommend for electrolysis. And when it comes to what hair color, what skin type, I've shared that with you already. No hair color or skin type is too light, too gray, too dark, too fierce for electrolysis to give you permanent removal forever, which let's face it, at the end of the day, all we're really trying to do for ourselves with getting rid of the unwanted hair is save time. Give yourself that time back and get rid of the frustration, the embarrassment, the irritation that comes with unwanted hair. I wish you all a happy, healthy, hair-free day. And you can always like, subscribe, leave a comment, ask me a question, anything, and I will try to answer it for you as best I can. Have a beautiful day. Bye.